These instructions are to help you install 360 bandits onto your Case 1200 series row units. Case 1200 series early riser planter row units utilize offset closing disc where one closing disc is oriented slightly ahead of the second disc. The disc orientation of the row units to the right side of the planter are mirrored to those on the left side of the planter. Therefore, row units on the left side of your planter are going to use different brackets than row units on the right side. Install the left and right hand kits accordingly. Left hand kits are part number 541600. They go on the left hand of the planter where the left disc is trailing. By contrast, right hand kits are part number 541601. They go on the right half of the planter where the right discs are trailing. The following instructions and pictures show the installation process for the 360 banded on a row unit from the left side of a planter utilizing a left hand kit. Using a chisel and hammer, remove the dust caps from each of the OEM discs. Using a 15 16 socket, remove the bolts and nuts that secure each disc and remove the discs. Bolts and nuts removed can be discarded as new hardware is provided, but keep the disc for reinstallation later. Remove and discard the 3 8 inch bolt from the cylinder arm. Place the provided 3 8 bolt through the left bandit bracket. Slide the bushing onto the bolt after the bracket. Then slide the bolt through the cylinder arm. On the back side of the arm, install the remaining bushing onto the bolt followed by the right bandit bracket. Secure with a nut and tighten slightly using a 916 socket and wrench, but leave this somewhat loose to allow for adjustment later of the disc assemblies. Using a side cutters, cut the two hose guides apart. The hose guides are side specific. They're gonna be labeled L for left, R for right. As always, left and right are determined as though you're sitting in the operator seat. On the left side of the row unit, run the 5 8 inch bolt through the left bracket, then through the hose guide. Then through the bushing. Then through the provided dust cap. Then the disc. and then the bottom hole on the cylinder arm of the row unit. Secure with a nut and tighten. You'll use the preceding steps on the opposite side of the row unit as well. And then once done, completely tighten the 3 8 inch bolt and nut on the cylinder arm that was previously left loose. You can route the bandit hoses through the hole in the top of the bracket. To assemble the plumbing fixtures, take the 3 8 push to connect, which also has a male quick connect fitting, and twist that male qu uh, quick connect into the top of the Y with the provided seal in between. Install the orifice plates into the grommets and place inside of the female quick connect caps. Then twist those caps onto the bottom side of the Y. Insert the hose guides into the bottom push connect fittings on the plumbing assembly. Your supply line will attach to the top 3 8 push to connect fitting. If the hoses aren't fully seated in the push to connect, they will leak. Hoses typically are going to seat about 7 8 of an inch deep or until you hear a slight snap. You can then secure the hoses to the row unit as you see fit with zip ties. And with that, the installation of your 360 Bandit is complete.